I'm the first person to be alone on an entire planet. Mark Watney is accidentally marooned on Mars. <laughs> he realizes the only way he's gonna get out of here is he's gonna travel 3,200 kilometers to rendezvous with the returning vehicle. I gotta live for 50 days inside a rover with marginal life support the size of a small van. So, in the face of overwhelming odds, I'm left with only one option. I'm gonna have to science the hell out of this. He has an epic journey to get to his point of departure, and he has to tear the two vehicles apart to create one badass vehicle that can make it to the other side of Mars. Our rover design is all-terrain based on agricultural vehicle with all-wheel steering and all-wheel suspension. It has no traditional axle because of the ground, so the wheels need to be able to do this independently. We thought this was an advantage. There is a functional picture vehicle which is actually going to be running across terrain very much like the surface of Mars on the deserts of Wadi Rao and perform for real. Work perfectly in my room. Perhaps NASA could take a page out of our design book, because they say generally they look to movies for new ideas. NASA are going to really like this stuff. I think they're going to say, can we have that and can we have that?